hi guys welcome back to another video of easy tutorials and today in this video we will learn how to add password a strength indicator on the website using html css and very simple javascript as you can see on my computer screen if i write something on this input field it is displaying the password is weak or password is strong or password is medium and it is also changing the text color and the border color of the input box so this is very easy to create this type of password strength indicator on the website so let's start this video here i have this folder and in this one I have one HTML file, one CSS file and one image that is an arrow icon. You can find the image download link in the video description. Now I will open these files with my code editor. So this is the HTML file and this one is the CSS file. In the HTML file I have added this link tag to connect the HTML and CSS file. Now we will add some code in the body tag that will be displayed on our web page. So here we will create a div with the class name container. Now we will add the CSS properties for this container. So add this class name in this CSS file. After that come back to the HTML file and here we will add one div with the class name input box. In this one we will add one input field with the input tag. Type will be password. Then we will add one ID, it is password and the placeholder also password. After that I will open this web page with the web browser. Now you can see one input field over here. Now we have to design this one so let's come back, copy this class name and write it here. For this input box we will add the CSS properties. Copy this one and add input. Now we will add the CSS for the input field. Now you can see the gray color border around this input box. Next we will add a button. In this button we will add one icon. For that I am using image tag. Now you can see this icon over here. Next we have to design this button so we will add the CSS properties for this one. So let's come back. Here we will add the button and let's add the CSS. Next we have to change the size of this icon. So copy this one then write img. Here we will add width. So it will change the size. Now we have to add a message below this input box. So let's come to the HTML file. Here we will add a p tag. In this p tag let's add a message. Password is Next we will add a id here. So the id is message. Copy this id so that we can add the CSS for this one. Now you can see this message here. We have to increase the size of this placeholder. So let's add placeholder and font size. Next we have to add the javascript so that we can display the strength of the password. Let's come back and in this html file before this closing body tag we will add the script tag. Script open and close. Here we will create some variable. Let's add this id password. Duplicate this line and this will be message. Now 
and here also we will add one variable before that we will add one span tag here in this html file span and with this span let's add one id so let's add the id of a strength copy this strength write it here and here let's add str strength now we have to add the event on the input box so for this input box we have the id password and the variable name is pass so let's add pass dot add event listener so the event will be input in this message we will add display none now it is hidden here we will add if pass dot value dot length greater than 0 then msg style dot display it will be block next we will add the same thing in the else condition but it will be display none so you can see this message is hidden but let's add anything in this text box this message is displaying if we delete the text this message is hidden up to this it is working fine now we have to check the strength so let's say if the password length is less than 4 then the password will be weak or if it is greater or equal to 4 then it will be medium and if it is more than 8 character then it will be strong so we have to add the same thing so let's add one if condition in this if condition again we will check the length write this one and here let's add if it is less than 4 then what will happen we will add this one str dot inner html equal to weak let's add a text here you can see it is displaying password is weak now just copy this one and here we will add else if if it is greater or equal to 4 and it should be less than 8 so let's add this one again less than 8 then the password will be medium let's add another condition else if if the password is longer than or equal to 8 character then what will happen the password will be strong so write this one strong so let's check this one if i will write some character it is password is weak let's increase the character now it is displaying password is medium let's add even more characters now it is displaying password is strong so this thing is working fine next we have to change the colors of the text and we will also change the color of the border of this input box so let's come to the first condition which is this one password is less than 4 so in this one we will add pass style 
dot border color so let's add the border color and we will also change the text color so let's add msg dot style dot color now just copy these two lines and add it in the other conditions and change the color it will be yellow now in the last one let's add another color code after updating this you can see if i type something this border becomes red and this text color is red password is weak let's increase the number of character in this password now it is saying password is medium and the color is yellow let's increase the number of character in the password now it is saying password is strong so this is how this password strength indicator is working fine i hope this video will be helpful for you if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section please like and share this video and also subscribe my channel easy tutorials to watch more videos like this one thank you so much for watching this video